So I uh, had a back and forth about where I'm going to live. I wasn't sure. I got to sit down. I'm so tired. You want me to film you or not? No. Okay. I'm so tired. I've been visiting different houses to look at because I already said the apartment requires me to make a lot more money than I already make, even though I can afford it. I started deciding, well, I better look for something. I, I know I can afford maybe a basement to myself with a private bathroom or some kind of like master bedroom where I have my own bathroom too. Saw a few places. One, a basement studio that no human being should rent. It was just... <laughs> disgusting and I saw two very nice places and the crazy thing is too my realtor got back to me and said okay somebody else applied for the apartment I was going for but because I was so persistent and there the landlords there his realtor really appreciated that he tried to set me up with another apartment that's available just one block over so it's still a great location eleven hundred dollars a month and they would accept me and not worry about the income requirements that they normally have. So I think they appreciate it. I tried to show my income and said, look, I can afford the place. I work hard. I'm not going to just let it go to chance that I'm not going to pay. But anyways, I ended up finding a place in Arlington, beautiful house, nice big bedroom. It's got my own bathroom, private bed. The bathroom looks brand new. It looks like a coat of glaze was put over everything and it's spotless and perfectly clean, smells good. And on and on, I won't go into too much detail, but the price is really good, the deposit's low, and it's a nice little quiet neighborhood where I can pull right up to the house any time of day. There's not a lot of traffic there. There's basically no traffic except the neighbors. And I can go in when I'm tired coming home from work and I'm 10 minutes away from your house. So it'll be nice when I'm tired, I don't oh have to drive back to God. Annandale. It, you... I don't even have to look at Annandale. <laughs> That's what I really and, don't want. Yeah, yeah it's general. a great neighborhood. It's a beautiful good neighborhood. house, by the way, and the landlord's super nice. That's something I liked, but she's got her own life. She doesn't need to be in my business. I don't need to be in hers. Exactly. And I think I'm the only person who lives on the floor I'm on. So there's other people in the house, but it's such a big house. She didn't even need to show me the rest of the house, and I'm never going to use the rest of the house. Hey, she showed me the kitchen, living room, and laundry, and I said, well, uh, do you want to show me anything else? She said, no. I was, I was like, okay, good. I don't need to. I barely need to leave my room because my room is so nice. My All the God. utilities included in the rent. I would have been paying more somewhere else for a lot less. But getting, you know, a place I'm not happy with and further away. I, again, I saw another beautiful place too, but this one is just right. The price was low and it was in a good location. And you know what? The landlord cares uh, yeah, about uh, You can the tell tenants. she takes pride in it. She's lived there a long time, has her own life, her own stuff going on doesn't need to I, she doesn't need to worry about me and i don't need to worry about her i gave her my whole deal told her my routine Cause some places they don't want you coming in late at night i actually got turned away from one place before i moved to annandale and it was down the street from where i live now where they said actually we decided we don't want somebody who comes home late because i was working late, working my late, night job late, then yeah, too yeah. i come home at three in the morning she's fine with that and everyone else is upstairs so she's like no it's not going to bother anyone it's just wonderful all around so it really worked out and, and now what i'm doing is i'm still going to make videos every day I'm working on more opportunities to make money. You know, I always have ideas, business ideas. I'm always trying to do stuff. And when I can afford a, an apartment of my own, I'm gonna be prepared to get a really nice one next time. Not just one I can sort of afford and I wanna move out because I'm desperate to leave where I am. I wanna have my choice of a really nice place. Unfortunately, everywhere here is so insanely expensive, so I'll have to make a lot of money by then. But I'm, I plan on it. I plan on doing it. So right however now, that happens, I'm gonna keep working yeah, hard. Right and, now, you lucky. You're fortunate to have this place. It is so nice. Beautiful. Big backyard. Oh my goodness. I can barbecue go outside and relax. Yeah, they have a big yeah. gas barbecue. And I barbecue like I sometimes. said before, I don't want to repeat myself, but the landlord care. They, mm -hmm. It's not like the, the, the other landlords you have. They're grabbing like the money person. in the house you are right now. Oh my God, it is. I, I wouldn't live in there. Right. I wouldn't live in there. And you know, it's a stressful time for me because it is kind of scary making changes and not knowing how things are going to go. But in reality, it's the best thing oh, for I me. Feel it's a good. great decision. Yeah. I'll be so glad to sit in this room and it's furnished too. I can cook there every day. The kitchen's beautiful. The fact that I have my own private bathroom in there is so nice. Beautiful bathroom, shower. I'm going to keep it spotless because that's how I like my bathroom to be anyways. Meanwhile, the bathroom I use now looks like it's falling apart. Literally like wood is popped out from the wall and the, it's, so the tie, the, it's not <laughs> tile on the floor. It's yeah. like, I don't know what you call it, like plastic trim almost on the floor. It's healing in certain yeah, spots like and coming up. And I can tell the landlord takes pride in the house too. So that's great. And I'll just, right. most of the time, I'll just do the same thing I'm doing now. Just work on my computer, 
relax there. Use You're the bathroom to hit whenever I want. Mind. Yeah, that's it. That's basically what I do. I sleep, eat, work on the computer. I don't really do a lot at the house. And I can pull up to my house late at night, right to the front door, not a, down the street and cross four lanes of traffic like I do now. Oh my yeah. gosh. So, and it's only a few weeks, a couple of weeks. That's yeah, it. July 1st, I moved. So thank you to everybody who supported the Annandale videos. I got to say, that was a big surprise. And it was a crazy few weeks. But even when I was worried about what was going to happen, I always knew I was in a good situation. Because right. even when I'm st stressed out and scared and worried, I knew I can figure out the best result. And at thanks any time. to all of you out there because you, with your understanding and your support. Yeah. Oh my and gosh, that over. means so much. Yeah. It means and so much. It's still not over because even when I'm living there, I'm thinking about how to make more money. And eventually, right. I want to have my own really nice apartment. Now, who knows how long that'll be? It takes time. Right to do that. I thought at first I probably might live at my place now for a year. I've been there two and a half years. So, you know, things end up taking longer than you expect, but that's fine. Whatever. That's I'm not worried about that. And it's more really it's glad. more yet to come. It's more to Great come. Place. It's more the moving, the more videos, yeah. Everything. Uh it's going to be interesting. It's really 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 I am so grateful and thankful. I'm you just glad I won't in. have to drive so far to go back to my house. Right. Like right now I'm exhausted. And I feel weird and messed up, and I gotta sleep and then put up the videos. Right. But this place, I'll just drive 10 minutes down the road, and it's in a nice neighborhood too. I grew up around it, so. Great. It'd be really great. Wonderful. Oh my God. Thank you, each and everyone out there. Thank you so much. Okay, that's it. Yeah. Huh? That's it? Yeah, that was really okay. nice. I Boy, just those freaking shrimp, they were so tender. Mm -hmm. God. What did I do to them? Shrimp video coming tomorrow, my mom's Yeah, that was so good, you know. I don't know what I did to it, but it's really good.